your Norcast weather update. Brought to you by Soaring Solar. Looking to cut down on your electric bill? Go solar with Soaring Solar, a veteran and family owned business located right here in South Jersey. Call today, 609 270 7759. And a very happy Tuesday morning, everybody. Hope you had a wonderful weekend. For the most part, Mother Nature cooperated, especially yesterday. You know, our backyard barbecues, our pool parties, the parades, the fireworks at night, we were taken care of. Today is not gonna be as nice as our humidity is gonna start to tick up a little bit. So ladies with the big hair, you know what I'm talking about. You're gonna have those issues not only today, but for the rest of the week as well. Hey, I wanna give a shout out to everybody I met at the Galloway uh, Parade yesterday. It's one of my favorite summertime events to attend. Uh, I met so many people. Uh, one guy walked up to me. He owns a, a big, I think it's called a, a deuce and a half. Correct me if I'm wrong. But uh, he came up to me, tells me he watches every day with his morning coffee. I appreciate you. Look, I wouldn't be where I am today if it wasn't for my awesome viewers. So uh, please always know that you guys mean the world to me. So uh, thanks for saying hi and taking pictures and uh, giving me a few seconds to uh, talk to each and every one of you. Right now, 68 degrees in Philadelphia, 66 in Virginia Beach, 71 in Dayton, Ohio, 81 in uh, St. Louis, 74 down in Myrtle Beach. So we are in relative uh, close proximity to where everybody else is. A little cooler for us because we had the low levels of humidity overnight. So a lot of us actually getting down into the lower 60s, the warmer weather out to our south and west, but not too far of a deviation, uh, relatively speaking, of course. 64 right now in Glassboro, 69 in Marlton, 64 in Mays Landing. One thing you're gonna notice, the winds are back out of the south and that is going to impact the level of humidity. I'll show you that in just a second. If you're traveling out there today, no issues. Green light across the board on your travel. By nine o'clock, we're expecting to get into the middle 70s. Sun and clouds mix. It's not gonna be as bright and beautiful as yesterday because we have something called the ring of fire. It's not one of those sensationalist uh, terms that was just fabricated to scare people. It's actually a thing. That means high pressures down to our south and west, and then on the northern edge of it, you get this northwest flow, and you typically get thunderstorms. That could be on the stronger side to develop on that northwest flow, so we need to watch radar mid and late afternoon today, and then again tomorrow, because there will likely be some severe weather popping up. I'm not saying it's gonna get all the way into New Jersey, but we should be weather aware. Most of the day is dry. We go back and forth between sun and clouds. But sometime mid-afternoon, we're gonna be watching for these scattered thunderstorms to pop up, maybe a little bit of an organized line or sorts uh, coming to come through or starting to come through. But that's about it. Then for the evening hours, we back off, partly to mostly clear skies overnight. We start tomorrow off on a nice note. Then again, in the afternoon, a chance of storms coming down on the Northwest flow, and we'll probably do it again on Thursday and Friday. So moral of the story here is don't go canceling your plans as is usually my message to those of you in the summer trying to get things together. Just pay attention to the forecast and how things ultimately develop. About 86 degrees today with that chance of showers and thunderstorms coming through later on. It's icky, it's sticky, it's swampy, it's soupy. So I don't know if I could say it's a terrific Tuesday to each their own. I'm sure there's a lot of you that actually do like this kind of weather. I'm just not one of them. 67 in Mays Landing, 67 your dew point in Atlantic City, 68 in Glassboro. The drier weather has been pushed back to the north and west. And unfortunately, we're gonna keep the dew points high all week long. Now, this is very important. Don't pay attention to relative humidity. It doesn't tell you anything. This tells you a whole lot. If you have pre-existing health conditions, you have to pay close attention to this because anything 65 or higher becomes an issue for your body to process that air. So you wanna take extra caution and precautionary measures to make sure that you're safe. Ocean water temperature today at 60 degrees, 79, your air temperature on the sand. Partly sunny and afternoon thunderstorm can't be ruled out and we're back down to a low rip current risk. We are uh, kind of sticky, uncomfortable tonight. We had that chance of showers and thunderstorms Lower 70s, that's about as cool as things are going to get, not like last night. On your hump day Wednesday, back up near 90 with that chance of thunderstorms again in the afternoon. So this takes us to our seven-day forecast here, and I mean, a lot of you are going to be happy with it. Others, maybe not so much. Our hottest day looks to be on Wednesday, then we cool down into the lower 80s right through the weekend. Chances of showers and thunderstorms going forward. No big surprise there. Have yourselves a wonderful day, everybody, and thanks so much for checking out the Norcast Weather Channel.